and welcome to another video. Today we are doing um, my Marvel DV collection cartoon stuff. So let me put my trainers down. Let's just pull the box here. The first thing I have is Spider Man, original Spider Man season 1, volume 1. This contains the first six episodes of the series. So. I pretty much completely finished the whole entire series of original Spider-Man, really, so... <clears throat> so, yeah, this is um, a little backstory about the series. It started in 1967 and it ended in 1970. Um, I don't have season 3, however, but I'm pretty sure I'll be finding season 3 eventually at some point. Um, on the other hand, here's the disc. Got Spider Man, and got yeah. That's season one, volume one. And then we have season one, volume two, episodes seven to thirteen. I think this was called the Trickster. I can't remember. It's a long time since I've seen this. A little backstory about the seat, the seat of this volume. This has good episodes, and some episodes were bad. All seasons have bad episodes, don't they? And there's the disc. And trust me, 1960 Spider-Man series and 70 were amazing animation. Iron Man, not so much. But you can definitely see they tried in the 90s. Um, <clears throat> and for season one, we have season volume three. Season one point three, and the Goblin. Back sorry, I did. I enjoyed all these episodes. So, <clears throat> even though it is just um, a three-season show, I still enjoy it today. No matter what happens, if people are saying I'm wrong of having the show. When I know I'm not, because I really enjoyed the, I really, I really love the show, as much as it was in the, in the 60s. Um, then we have original Spider-Man season two, volume one. I found this in the complete box set with volumes two and yeah, with volume two. Um, there's the DVD backstory about the season. Started in. 1968, I believe. I can't remember, but I'm, I'm. Let me know in the comments down below. Tell me what year season two aired of original Spider-Man. Let me know. Um, it's original Spider-Man season two, one two. We have Mysterio in this. There's the disc. Um, yeah, this has some good episodes. So that was. These were all of my original Spider Man DVDs. There. Moving on to Spider Man's Amazing Friends. There's only season one, and I only have two episodes, which feature Triumph of the Green Goblin and Crime of All Centuries. So, yeah. The whole concept about this is, before this, there was another Spider-Man show called Spider-Man 5000. I haven't even got that series yet. But here's the cover. As you can see, it's really glossy. Not glossy, but, you know. This features Spider-Man, Firestar, and Iceman. Two of which are my favourite characters, besides Spider-Man. And the back. Um, backstory about the series. I only lost like for see three seasons, and so much this people would say this would come came before Spider-Man Five Thousand. I went on Wikipedia a couple of days ago <coughs> and found that this actually came after Five Thousand. So it's all continuity. Don't you just don't you just hate continuity? I certainly do. Now, my favourite series of them all has to be Spider-Man. I made a video a while back. I made a video 
um, about this series, so you all know about what that video is, and you all know what I'm going to talk about now. <laughs> I have all seasons, I have season one, really good season, Venom's good in this, it's his first time in like, it's his first time in a cartoon, like seriously, where's he been for like the last couple of 55 years? Yeah, where the last has he gone? There's the disc. That's season one. Really good. I'm not a big fan of season two, but it's still a pretty good season. It, it, it features the X-Men, which are pretty cool, in my opinion. Season three features Daredevil. I really enjoyed this series. It's better than season two. But it's not better than season four, in my opinion. But still good. But it's definitely better than season two. And then season four, a brilliant series, features uh, the Punisher. Never thought it was Punisher and um, Daredevil. Not Daredevil. Punisher and um, Blade would. I never considered them as Marvel characters. Even I don't even see Elektra as a character as well. That's just that, the, and Ghost Rider, those four characters, they're involved in, um, in Marvel Knights. So I don't have any of them. I do have the movies, though. I don't have Blade movies. I do have a Ghost Rider movie and a Daredevil movie. Those are the only two superheroes that are actually, are actually in the Marvel Universe. Okay, that's just never made a speak. Seems like I've never made a squeaky soys. Nice, but there you go. Disc one, two. Really good season. Edit. The show ended in a weird way, but. I'm going to show you end that way all the time. Moving away from Spider Man, um, we're moving into X Men with X Men Season 1, Volume 1. I really enjoyed X Men, actually. It's. Well, I know it's not better than Spider Man any day, it's not better than Spider-Man any day, but it was in the same time as around as, as around this. Um, but I still love X-Men. I have two DVDs, so that's good when you have DVD. Now if you met a lot of, um, what's it called, VHS, they would have X-Men episodes on that, and you wouldn't have to click on a remote. Um, so you don't have that problem like, oh, is it if, it, if it's in Swedish, Polish, nor English, and it's on VHS, and you can't change the language, then DVD, it's good for you. Oh, this is season one, volume three, ish. When I say ish, I mean there was another one which was episodes eight and nine, which I haven't got yet. But I am collecting the X Men. Actually, I'm collecting the X Men DVDs. Moving away from Iron Man, moving from Captain America, or whatever. We're moving into Fantastic Four, Season One, Volume Two. I'm just gonna know. I actually love Fantastic Four. I know people hate Fantastic Four, but I love Fantastic Four. Okay. Um, you can hate me all you want, but I love Fantastic Four. So it's really complex. Um, there was a sequel series after Fantastic Four finished. It was a Silver Surfer series. It only lasted for one season, like Spider-Man Unlimited was a sequel to the 994 series of Spider-Man. Which, of course, I'll show you again, was this. But, I still love Fantastic Four. Not as much as not much as X Men, but and Spider Man, but I do love it. Oh, that wrong DVD. <laughs> um, we have season two, volume two. Mhm. Mm this is actually the only disc that actually works out of the two discs. Moving away from Fantastic Four, moving into Iron Man with uh, three seasons. Actually, there was three seasons. One of which season one was in the 60s, and two seasons was from 1990, 1994 was season two, 
1996 for season three. So here's season one. Here's disc one, season one, volume one. Yeah, that is a weird Iron Man. Don't don't believe that's actually Iron Man. Um, like I said at the beginning of the video, Spider-Man 1996 series animation was pretty better than this. Iron Man, poor, absolutely poor. Well, only for the first season's poor, but I guess all seasons are poor in most parts. And then season one, one, two. Then to note, I have not finished the 60 series because I'm not interested in the 60 series. Which I'm only interested in the 90 series of it, of stuff. <sighs> yeah, moving on into season two, around 1994, season two. Um, so season two, volume one. It's, it's interesting to note this is a really good season. CGI in the first episode is a bit bad, but that's just because it's Iron Man. I mean, it has always got bad CGI, but that doesn't really matter. It doesn't really matter. And they got season two, volume two. Now I actually have all three seasons. Which is really cool. And, the, and this all work. And then finally for this video, season three. Season three volume one. There's a DVD. And finally season three volume two. Let me know in the comments in down below. What's your favourite Marvel cartoon series of sixties seventy 60s, 80s, or 90s. It could be Spider Man, it could be Fantasy IV, it could be Iron Man, it could be Incredible Hulk, it could be Captain America, Thor, Silver Surfer, X Men. Just let me know, guys, and that is it for this video. Like, comment, and subscribe, and I'll see you for more videos such as this one. Ta ta ta, everyone!